the premier simulation basketball is coming to you live as we bring you the Cincinnati Majestic coming into town to take on the San Francisco Monsters. I'm James Olson bringing you the solo action here tonight. Kind of crazy, but hey, it's on GSSN, the Global Simulation Sports Network. Thank you for tuning in to the PSB Premier Simulation Basketball. So both teams looking for a big dub here tonight. However, the big change that has happened recently, Mickey Hartman was recently traded to Seattle from San Francisco for Tyler Cook. This will be the first game for Cook here in the Monsters uniform. Can he help this team out? However, Cincinnati definitely trying to look for their first dub of the season. Can they do it here against the Monsters? Tip-off was won by San Francisco, and here we go, underway. We're going now with the ball. Now he's going to kick it on over. And we're going to start off with some nice ball movement. Letterman now with the ball up top. Looks to drive. Cuts back to his left. Looks up the shot clock. Crowd is going into it. Shot clock cheese coming into effect. Launch three attempt right there. Hits the back of the rim. Could not get that one to go. Cincinnati with the rebound. Majestic are looking for their first win here tonight. Air ball is not going to help you on that one. To start this game and the crowd here in San Francisco knows about it. And a nice little layup right there to start off the game for the San Francisco Monsters. Well, James now with the ball. Kicks on over to Hill. Jacob Hill now swings it on over to Bolton. Bolton wants to drive inside. Up, over. Tries to kiss off the glass. Cannot get to go. Ian Letterman with the rebound. Binfield now with the ball. Spin move. Pump fakes. Up, over. Could not get that one to go. Nathaniel Binfield in his last game a loss to St. Louis. 18 points. Definitely looking to put up that same number here tonight, if not better. Benfield with the rebound after the miss attempt right there by Cincinnati. We're going now. Gets it on in. 11. Fade away. Gets a two to go right there. And it's a early 4 0 lead to start this game for the Monsters. Jacob Hill, the top point guard in the PSB in the draft. Tries to get inside. Clum now. He will miss that one right there. Kenneth Clum had the defense draped all over him. Letterman now looks it back down his man. Up inside the paint. Pump fakes a couple times. Could not get that one to go. Bolton will be charged with the shooting foul on that one right there. So as we take this early break, we do want to talk about Global Simulation Sports Network. They are making some big changes. Obviously, the Premier Simulation Basketball has been its main focus. However, due to recent changes there will be the expansion of simulation baseball association yes the sba will be coming very soon to gssn as well as fans have been clamoring and asking about is there going to be wrestling coming soon that we will have to wait and see so both attempts go right there and is now a six nothing lead to start off for the monsters Hill now looking to set something up here for the Majestic. Want to take a step back. Now he hands it on off to Clum over there in the corner, and he gets a three to go. And that's the first basket for Cincinnati. Monsters looking to set something up here. Try to get it on down low to Mickey Hartman, the new acquired player. And he gets his first two points here for the San Francisco Monsters. Field goals to this point obviously is still early on. However, the Monsters have made 60% of their shots. Quickly inside to Klum. Klum tries to get it up and over. Hartman will actually make that one not go in. And there is another miss. And there's Hartman getting the pass inside, throwing it on down. Mickey Hartman making a big statement early on in his debut here for the San Francisco Monsters. Joshua Bolton, we just saw some statistics in his last game against Birmingham. 22 points. He will get an assist right there, getting it over to Jacob Hill for two. 
him and now tries to go back inside the heart man getting blocked right there and here come the Cincinnati Majestic back on offense Hill now getting the ball from James now sets it up wants to get it on over to Klum Klum now fake passes looking for the screen to the left he's gonna take it he's gonna spin now gets it back to James that's over to Martin Mitchell. A couple pump fakes, not gonna happen. Stolen away right there on the pass. And here come the monsters. Up and over, Dan Levin, two-hand jam. And is a 12 to five lead with just over five left here in the first quarter. Cincinnati needs to find a way to get the lid off the basket. I know they've got a few points right now, but they need to get something going their way if they wanna stay in this game. Hill now with the ball back up top. Kicks that on over. Bolton for three. Bang! Gets that three to go. Joshua Bolton, the fourth, with a long three dagger. And it is now a 12 to 8 game. Hartman now kicks on a back left and gets that one to go from long range to answer back with his own three. James now brings the ball on up for the Majestic. Hill wants a drive. He's on and over to Mitchell. He's going to get blocked right there. Here come the Monsters back on offense. Letterman stop pops at the free throw line. Could not get that one to go. Clum with the rebound. And here come the Majestics. Hill now thought he was going to take the screen. Did not take that screen. Now he's going to get down back over to Clum on the left side. Clum now looking to take the screen from James. Switch right there. Now it's on back. Jacob Hill looking to the shot clock. Hand all up in his face. Could not get the three-pointer to go. Almost got tipped back in. And here come the Monsters. Tipped out of bounds right now. It will still be Monsters ball. And we will be taking a quick timeout right now. 15-8, to 8, 336 left here in the first. This is PSB on the GSSN. Don't go anywhere. We still got more action coming your way. Get ready for the Deer Squad! And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to PSB Action here on the Global Simulation Sports Network. James Olson bringing you the solo mic here tonight. It's still going to be hot, baby. You know it will be. Monsters have a 15 to eight lead right now. 336 left here in the first quarter. Monsters have definitely done a lot of things to get the ball inside and they've been able to match it up on defense as well. So the inbound will go to the Monsters. Substitution for both teams have definitely happened during the timeout. Bird now gets it over to Vason. Not gonna happen. Overton will get the rebound for the Majestic. As you can see on the screen right now, rebounds to this point. The Monsters have a 7-5 lead on the rebound category. Trying to get inside to Nige. Nige is now going to kick it on out. Here comes the ball movement here by the Majestics. Launch three attempt out with a little bit of a lean. Vassal with the rebound for the Monsters. And now here comes San Francisco back on offense. Quickly trying to drive inside, kiss off the glass. Bird will get that one to go. Great Bird with two points right there for the Monsters. Highly acclaimed bench player for sure in the PSB. Turnaround jumper for the Majestics, not gonna go and Bird will get the rebound. Quickly trying to get it on up. And a quick foul right there as Andrews will be charged with the blocking foul. He's holding his knees. Maybe something happened. Now he seems to be shaking it off pretty good. So just a little disappointment right there on the foul. 2.30 left here in the first. It's a 17 to eight Monsters lead over the Majestics. Quickly trying to go inside. I was trying to figure out what was going on. And Johns Jr. will get the foul right there, sending the Monsters back to the line. Number three. Mince is Two looking shots. to add to this lead for San Francisco. Early on here in the season, we have seen a lot of great action throughout the league. The St. Louis Reign, the Detroit Jackals have definitely been putting up some great, great things, as well as 
We have the New York Griffins. Their twin towers are being led by Ant Thomas. The Chicago Goats, Jacksonville Piranhas. The whole league in general is just being very, very well-rounded. I know it's still very early on. And we do have some teams that are still struggling a little bit. Such as San Francisco and Cincinnati. But hey, it's still early on. Somebody will be able to get out of that slow. So the attempt right there was able to go on down as an 18 to 8 game. Andrews just floating that one up. Was hoping for a wing and a prayer on that one, but it would not go. Fasten out wide open in the paint. Gets the two to go. And it is now a 20 to 8 game. Just under two minutes left here in the first. Andrews with the ball. Now gets on down to John Juniors. There's a whole bunch of players. Wide open, missing that one right there. James John Jr.'s 10 points in his last game against Birmingham coming off the bench. Of course, the Majestics, one of these teams, is definitely not doing that well. Getting not a win in the column and a block right there. Man, oh man, what authority on that block. Swat that one in. Probably the 13th row if I can count from where I'm at right now. So inbound to the Monsters. Quick shot right there. Gets the two to go. And a timeout by the Majestic. 122 left here in the first. It is becoming a very nasty game. Monsters definitely with the early commanding lead. This is PSB on the GSSN. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Premier Simulation Basketball. James Olsen bringing you the hot mic here tonight in the Bay Area. San Francisco with a 22-8 lead over the Cincinnati Majestic. It is still very early on. Coach is able to talk to their players. Hopefully Cincinnati can get this slump to go away. So now it's the inbound by the Majestics. Andrews now bringing the ball on up. Oh, nice little spin move. Broke his man for a minute, but he was able to come right back to it. However, Grant had hit him on the way up, and that will send the Majestics back to the line. It's the inaugural season, and the Majestic had the number one pick, and they took Jacob Hill, their point guard. They also have picked a few other good players as Joshua Bolton, Kenneth Klum, Lyle James, you name it. The rest of this squad is very solid on paper. However, with the losses right now, I mean, it's, again, very early in the season. I hope that this team can actually pull out of this slump. One of the free throws does go on down right there for Andrews. And is now a 22 to 9 game, just over a minute left here in the first. Monsters now trying to get something going their way. Had to kick it on back. It's over in the left corner now. Looks to drive. Mince now. Wanda Aliou could not get to go in their favor. Miscommunication right there. What wasn't a miscommunication was this amazing block right there, sending that into the stands deep out there. There's a souvenir. Nige with the nice, amazing block to make sure that this lead does not advance another two points. 22 to nine, under a minute left. Andrews with the ball for Cincinnati. Wants the ISO, wants to go inside, step back. Will have to pick up his dribble. Now he wants to get it over to Overton. Overton getting swatted away right there. Quick three attempt, missed that one right there. Vassal hitting him on the way up. And that is going to now send the Majestic to the line for three shots. San Francisco, another team that has had its, you know, little bit of woes here and there. Again, early on in the season, it'll definitely be shaking cobwebs very soon. This team, Led by Eaton Letterman, the big man, 
definitely, definitely wants to show out with his team, including Tony Time Ragone. There's a few other big names, Dan Levin on this squad, you name it, and as well as the pickup they recently had trading Tyler Cook early on in the season for Mickey Hartman. Hartman started off pretty strong here in the first quarter. So the first attempt didn't go on down, the, the second one will. At least trying to close out a two for three here at the line. Could it happen in the Majestic's favor? Nigel's shot is up and it is good going two for three and is now a 22-11 game. Shot clock and game clock about 11 second difference. Grant now wants to ISO, tries to go inside. He's gonna be stopped right there and getting met with the defense. However, it is a traveling violation. Roll your arms on that one, folks. Grant shaking his head in disbelief on that one. Shot clock is now turned off to end this first quarter. Andrew's looking to hold the ball. Now he wants to go inside. He found an opening, could not get it to go. And here comes San Francisco, looking to hold off for the last shot. And here comes Bird, a little ISO, gets it to go with .2 left on the clock. And ladies and gentlemen, at the end of the first quarter, the Monsters take a commanding 24 to 11 lead. Heading into the second, can Cincinnati change it around? Or will the Monsters, well, show how much of a monster they can be in this game? This is Premier Simulation Basketball on the GSSN. Don't go anywhere. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Premier Simulation Basketball. James Olsen bringing you the hot and fuego might here tonight. And let's see if Cincinnati can make something happen. Klum getting hit right there. Gets the shot to go. Mickey Hartman will get the shooting foul on that one. Sending Klum to the line. As you can see on the screen right now, Klum has been pretty much the only thing that has really done well in this game for the Majestics. The rest of the team needs to step it on up. Mickey Hartman, the newly acquired player for the San Francisco Monsters, getting the hit right there. So Klum now looking for the and one opportunity. Gets it to go. 24-14 here in the second quarter. Tony Timer going now with the ball. Looks to cut back. Now gets it on over to Nathaniel Ventfield. Ventfield. From the PSB logo, gets that two to go. Field goals to this point right now, the Majestic 4 of 17, 24 shooting. However, the Monsters, an astounding 65% on the floor. Klum now with the ball up top. Jacob Hill's stat is the last game against Birmingham. Klum going inside. Nice take right there with the reverse. We were going to start talking about Hill and his eight points in the loss against Birmingham. However, he did put up a few other stats with assists and rebounds. Trying to have an at least a somewhat decent all-around night. We're going. Tries to lob it inside. Could not get that one to go. Costly turnover. Quickly over into the other corner. Bang! Gets the three to go. And the Majestics are coming out hot in this second quarter. Chipping away as much as they can on this lead. 26-19. Benfield with the ball up top for the Monsters. Now gets it on over to Letterman. Nice ball movement. We're going now. Free throw line. Now kicks it on back to Letterman. Shot clock about to be a factor. Pump fake. Launch three attempt right there. Levin shot could not go. Quickly the Majestic bringing it on up. Spin move by Bolton. Bolton launching for two. Ill-advised shot in my book on that one. Was just trying to force something up, maybe try to get the hack to go to the line. We're going now. Oh my goodness, he kind of broke his man a little bit. Letterman with the ball. Now kicks it on back over to Mickey Hartman. Hartman looks up at the clock, realizes the shot clock is about to be a factor. Deep three. Could not get that one to go. 
Oh, but a steal right there by Ventfield gets that one to go right there. Way to stay with it. Points off turnovers at this point. Five for the Majestic, four for the Monsters. Turnovers. Cincinnati's only had two. San Francisco has turned the ball over three times. Hill now gets on into Klum. Klum getting blocked right there. Monsters from defense to offense trying to capitalize on this situation. Tony Timer going. Now cuts back to the left. Wants to set it back up. Gets on over to Ventfield. Ventfield for three. Bang! Gets it to go. Nathaniel Ventfield with the long range bomb. And is now 31-19. Lob inside. James almost had that one for a highlight jam, but he lost it. Quick three attempt right there. Wow. Wow. Man, oh man, here come the monsters answering back. Bolton now gets it on over to Hill. Hill looks to drive. Two-hand jam. Welcome to your Kodak moment. Hanging on the rim for a little, little bit of salt in the wound right there. We're going now. Brings the ball on up. Gets it on over to Letterman. Letterman up on the logo. Hartman now looks to take that screen. Wants to go inside. Floater gets blocked right there. Martin Mitchell with the rebound. Now it's uh, it's a little bobbled, but it's still in the hands of Bolton. Looks to pump fake. Has to kick it on back to Mitchell. Mitchell getting swatted right there. He had monsters all over him. There was no way of getting that shot off. Letterman now wanting to set something up here. Playing point guard a little bit. Now he gets it over to the real point guard in Ragon. Harmon with the ball up top again, looking at the shot clock. Couple step backs, has to get over to Letterman. Letterman launching a three, not gonna happen. Jacob Hill, the point guard for the Majestic with the rebound. And another steal here by the Monsters. Quickly trying to get inside. Letterman, too short on that one. Not gonna go on that trip. Hill now over in the corner, James. and it was a two-pointer by Lyle James. Lyle James this season right now, 15 points per game for the Majestic. He's definitely trying to do his contributions on scoring, that's for sure. Especially since he's playing at a smaller height, and he is going to be playing in the center position. Ragon two-hand jam! Where was the defense on that one? Field goals to this point right now, 58% for San Francisco, 33 for Cincinnati. Hill now looks it wide open, Klum, Klum with a little authority on that one. A little bit of flair, assist for Hill, and we are taking a quick timeout. 36-25, 341 left here in the first half. This is PSB. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. Kenneth Klum sending us the commercial with a nice two-handed jam. 36-25, 3-35 and counting here in the second quarter. Substitutions obviously happen during the commercial break. Bird now with the ball for the Monsters. Bird now getting it stolen away. Here comes Cincinnati Andrews quickly up. Nice. Gets hacked right there by Stewart. And that is now going to send Cincinnati back to the line. This second corner has been a very good turnaround for the Majestic. They have been able to claw away at this lead. Bringing it, well, to a point it was single digits. Now they still have the opportunity to do it if these free throws can go. First one will go on down to bring it to at least a 10 point game. Monsters, however, have been able to keep up their momentum on this early, early game. Nigel's second attempt is up and it is good and it will bring it back to single digits. 36-27. Free throws to this point. The Majestic able to hit 75% at six for eight. However, the Monsters same, 75%. However, they are 3 for 4 at the line. Launch 3 attempt right there. Bang! Gets that one to go. 
Monster is definitely putting on a clinic from the long range here today. Miss attempt right there by the Monsters. Or excuse me, the Majestic. Monsters with the rebound. Wide open in the corner right there. Oh my goodness, where was the defense? Drake Bird with the three-point bomb in the corner and is now 42-27. Anders spin move wanted to get something to go his way. He's not going to get that one. However, he gets it on into James Johns Jr. for the two-handed flush. Monsters looking to capitalize. Here comes Bird. Kicks it on back now, and it's out of bounds. Costly, costly turnover by the Monsters. Don't want to have that happen. So we are about to reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. Andrews now looks to drive. Up over with the contact. Could not get to go. Grant with the rebound. For San Francisco, quick shot in the corner for three. Bang! Gets that one to go. Bird yet again making it fly from long range. Nice now, spin move. Comes up short on the two. Vessel with the rebound. Monsters now looking to get something going here. Can they at least add on to this lead before halftime? Grant, pump face, looks to drive inside. Too strong, hits the back of the rim. Overton with the rebound for Cincinnati. Nige now with the ball. Back to Andrews. Now it's going on down to Johns Jr. Spin move. Pump fake's not going to get anything going his way. And there will be a blocking foul by Burry. Blocking Haskins on that drive. Another foul for Bird. And the Monsters. Just over a minute left. Almost tipped away for a steal for the Monsters. However, Nige was able to keep that ball. He's going to float it up. Could not get that one to go for two. Rebounds to this point. Monsters 19. Majestic 12. One of those, of course, is an offensive rebound for Cincinnati. Mintz now looks to drive to the left. Wants to lob it up. Oh my god, Vassal with the freaking two-hand alley-oop jam. Got me out of my seat, ladies and gentlemen. I about lost my cool. <laughs> man, oh man. What a two-point just throwdown right there. Miss attempt by Cincinnati on that one. Shot clock and game clock about five seconds difference. Grant now with the ball. Shot clock about to be a factor. Launch three attempt by Bird. Bang! Gets it to go. And it is now 50 to 29. Last shot coming in the way of Cincinnati right here. Andrews, pump fakes, kicks it on back. Haskins for three. Gets it to go at the buzzer. And at the halftime score, it is 50 to 32. And welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to a PSB game between the Cincinnati Majestic and the San Francisco Monsters. 50-32 is the score coming into the second half. Cincinnati with the ball to start this. Mitchell gets the three to go. And he's going to start off with a nice little bang to get this third quarter going. Monsters have had a commanding lead pretty much all game. Oh, 
Almost got a dunk right there. We're going getting stripped away on the dunk attempt. James now. He's going to get it stolen away. Here come the monsters. Mickey Hartman now bringing the ball on up. Cuts back to the right. Goes baseline. He Now he's going to get stolen. Mitchell now stopping that one. Bolton with the ball now here for Cincinnati. Now gets on down to Clum at the free throw line. Shot clock about to be a factor. Clum's got to get something going. Kicks it on back wide open. Bolton for three. Bang! Three. three points. Joshua Bolton the fourth with a three point bomb. And it is now 50 38. Letterman now. Gives it on over to Ragon. Ragon was wide open, but he looks to drive inside. Getting met by Leal James in the low post. Bolton now wants to drive. Goes up. Throws it down with the right hand. Cocked back and threw it on down. Scoring there at this point. Drake Bird coming off the bench with 13. Bolton with 11. Tony time. Looking to do some Tony time, obviously. Could not get that one to go right there. Stolen away. And here comes the Majestic back on offense. Hill now with the ball up top. Looks to get inside to Clum. Clum getting blocked right there. Both teams coming out very strong on the defensive end. Steals and blocks galore from both teams. We're going now. Hands it off to Letterman. Back up top. Hartman with the ball. Wants to get the screen to the left side. He's going to cut back. Now he's going to go again. Now he's met up by Mark Mitchell. Shot clock about to be a factor. No. Way to stay alive with it. Could not get that shot to go. Wide open three attempt for Cincinnati. Bang! Man, oh man. Bolton just coming out hot here in the third quarter. That is why he is the scoring leader for the Majestic in this game thus far. Hartman behind the back. Up against Klum. Now let's kick it on back to Ragone. Ragone versus Hill. Nice little point guard matchup right there. Looks to go inside. Floats it up. Could not get to go. Hill will be charged with the foul right there. Sending Tony Time Ragone to the line. 50-43 is the score. 6-0-4 left here in the third quarter. Monsters have definitely been putting on a show here tonight in front of the home fans in San Francisco. Cincinnati started off very, very rough. They have been able to climb back as much as they possibly can in this game. Still down, but a, there's still time. There is still time. So the first attempt does go on down for Tony Time Ragone. We're going second shot comes up a little short. James with the rebound for Cincinnati. 35.3 rebounds per game. 11th in the league right now for Cincinnati. And able to put up a little bit right there. And oh my goodness, that block getting swatted into the crowd. Man, oh man. And speaking of blocks, check out this block from earlier in the game. Wow. Just wow. 51-43, Cincinnati looking to inbound. Mitchell now gets it on over to Bolton. Bolton quick two right there. Gets it to go, and it's now a six-point game for the Monsters. We're gone now. Takes it back to the left, off the screen. Almost loses it, stays with it. Just launches him, gets the two to go. A very tough shot right there. A 13-3 run here for the Majestic. San Francisco trying to stop the bleeding here in the third. Klum now, could not get that one to go. Mickey Hartman with the rebound. Quickly bringing it up to Letterman. Letterman looks to drive, gets blocked from behind. Ventfield now, could not get to go. Cincinnati was all over the low post on that one. And an out of bounds right there, costly turnover for one Jacob Hill for his Cincinnati Majestic. Monsters looking to capitalize off the turnover. 
Letterman now gets it on over to Hartman on the left side. Looks for that screen, wants to go, stops, gets it over to Levin. Levin now gets hit right there, no foul. Plenty of contact to stop that shot. And Cincinnati back on offense. Quick three attempt right there by James. Man, oh man, what a shot right there. A timeout by San Francisco, 53-48. 437 left in the third quarter. This is PSB on the GSSN. Coming back from commercial break, San Francisco 53, Cincinnati 48. The Majestic are just chipping away as much as they can. Levin now gets a two to go. So here comes the Majestic back up the court. Nice little shot right there on the last possession. Klum now inside, has kicking out back. Bolton gets the shot to go for three. I thought his foot was just a little bit over. That is his 19th point, 13, ladies and gentlemen. Count it, 13 in this quarter alone. Bolton is hot. Grant now with the ball for the Monsters. Spin move. Now cuts back the other way with another spin move. Hop steps. Tries to go up and over. Hill gets it to go for two. Grant with four points, two of three shooting right here. And now a timeout by Cincinnati. 57-51, 3.38 left here in the third quarter. This is Premier Simulation Basketball on GSSN. Don't go anywhere. James Olsen bringing you the hot mic here tonight in San Francisco. The Bay Area is rocking with their monsters with a 57-51 lead here against the uh, Cincinnati Majestic. I had to think who they were playing for for a second. 3.38 left here in the third quarter. Majestic looking to inbound here by the scorer's table. A sold-out capacity crowd here at Uber, Urban, excuse me, not Uber. <laughs> it's been a long day, ladies and gentlemen. Urban Mover Arena. Haskins now with the ball. Now gets it on over to Nige. Nige has been very, very good coming off the bench. Looks to drive to the right, cuts back to the left. Up, over, could not get that one to go. And now here comes... The Monsters. Rebounds to this point. The Monsters with 24. Majestic with 18. Both teams registering at least one offensive rebound. Stolen away right there. Here comes Cincinnati back on offense. Wide open. Three for Bullen. Gets it to go. It is now a three-point game. 57-54. Just under three minutes left here in the third. Bird now looks to drive. Kicks it on over into the corner to Stewart. Cuts to the left. Looks to go inside. Left-handed layup gets it to go. Field goals to this point right now. Majestic with 57. Excuse me, 43 monsters with 57. Like I said, it's been a long day. Coming here on the West Coast. Missed shot right there. Here comes Vassal and the monsters. Nige with the rebound. Stopping that attempt right there in its tracks. Andrews floater gets it to go for two and it's back to a three point game. Cincinnati right now 25.7 assists per game. They have 18 here tonight, almost meeting what they have done this season thus far. Grant now stops, pops for two, could not get to go. Nige with the rebound for Cincinnati. Majestic back on top with Andrews. Going inside and is now a one point game. Look at the field goal percentage. It started off 19%, went to 50, and now it's at a steady 67. Nige with the rebound. Missed attempt right there. Here comes Majestic missing that one right there. Bird getting the rebound. Could have taken the lead, but oh, the alley oop jam on the other way. Vassal throwing it down with the right hand. 
keeping the lead alive for San Francisco. Bolton now looks to tie it. Could not get to go. It rattled around. Would have been a very big clutch shot right there. Monsters with the ball. Now it's with Stewart at the arena logo. Drake Bird now looks to cut inside. Step back. Launches it for two. Comes up short. Another rebound here for Cincinnati. Mads now looks to drive, kicks it on over into the corner. Andrews now looks to cut back, goes back up top, kicks it on over. Cincinnati has to get this going their way. They have shot clock about to be a factor. Stop, Pop Haskins gets it to go. Oh my goodness. And one opportunity right there. Vessel with the charge right there on that shooting foul. Bolton will substitute out for James Johns Jr. And of course the Monster is making some changes as well. Hartman coming back in as well as Ragone. Cincinnati has literally clawed their way back into this game. Haskins looking to tie it up. And we are at 61 all. 32.1 left here in the third quarter. This game is getting very, very good, ladies and gentlemen. Mintz now with the ball. Cuts over to the left. Stops. Almost stolen away. Vassal gets blocked right there. It's out of bounds. Monsters will get the ball back. What has sparked for the Cincinnati Majestic in this game? They have just clicked it on all cylinders. Started off very, very poor. And they have now turned it around to tie this game. Launch three attempt right there. Bang! Hartman answers with a wide open three. Shot clock is turned off. Ten seconds left here in the third. Andrews with the ball cuts to his left. Stops. Now he's going to go to and gets hit right there. 2.4 left on the clock. Razone will be charged with the foul. Andrews going to the line at least can bring it back to a one point game possibly if he can knock two for two. This game is becoming one highlight reel after another and the fact that this game has now pretty much come so so close. One has to wonder could this be a PSB top 10 game of all time. I know it's still very early on in the season folks but you never know what could happen. So the first attempt goes down, bring it to a two-point game. Andrews could at least bring it within one. The crowd is getting louder and louder as we speak. Andrews' shot is up, rattles around, could not get to go. Vassal will get the rebound, and that will end the third quarter with the Monsters up 64-62. Cincinnati clawing their way back into this game. Could they take their lead, or will Monsters hold on to this game? Stay tuned. And we are ready for the fourth quarter. Put the four fingers up, ladies and gentlemen. The PSB is rocking here tonight. Stolen away to start this off. Mitchell grabs that ball. Hill advised pass right there. James now gets on into Hill. Hill gets blocked right there. Almost went in. But of course the ball did not. So, hey, that is very, very lucky. On the other end now. Clum launching it for three. Could not get to go. There's a foul right there. Loose ball by Letterman. That will be his first personal taking down the aisle. James on that play. The next eight minutes and 31 seconds are going to be crucial in this game. Cincinnati has clawed their way back. They are putting up a dogfight here tonight. However, San Francisco trying to hold on to get this dub. Hill tries to cut both ways, could not get the shot to go. Ragon brings the ball back up for the Monsters. Calling the ISO, now he's going to get over to Ventfield. Ventfield looking to get on down to Hartman, but of course the defense from Cincinnati still wide open. Man, oh man, it was like the Red Sea had parted, and now Ventfield, 18 minutes in this game, and he has put up 12 points. 
Jacob Hill looks to drive. Could not get to go. Too strong. We're going with the rebound. Quickly tries to get it inside. Ventfield not going to get it his way. And he will be going to the line. Klum will be charged with the foul. We just saw just a second ago Jacob Hill four points in this game. Not really producing on the scoring end. But he's got nine assists for Cincinnati. So he's at least putting up the offensive openings for the Majestic. First attempt is good. Substitutions will be on the court. Of course, now you see Bolton the fourth coming back in here for Cincinnati. A very big spark in my mind if you can bring Bolton back out and he could put up the numbers that he has been doing. Ventonfield now. Gets the attempt to go. It is now back to a six point Monsters lead. And a quick timeout here by the Majestic, 68-62. Monsters looking to hold on. This is James Olsen bringing you PSB action on the GSSN. And we are back, ladies and gentlemen. 7.45 left here in the fourth quarter. A crucial 7.45. Cincinnati looking to take their first lead in this game, hopefully, as they have clawed their way back into this game. However, the Monster is looking to steal that ball and do something on the offensive end now. We're going to lay up. Could not get to go. Hill will be charged with the foul. Tony time. We're going, going to the line. He has been very, very efficient as much as he possibly can here tonight for the Monsters. Finding some open looks with his team, getting the assist, getting a few points here and there. He is looking to at least lock down the dub in the Bay Area. First attempt is good, bringing it to a seven point game now for the Monsters. Do not fault out Cincinnati at this point. I am very shocked to say that they almost almost took their first lead of this game we're going second shot is up and it is good brings it to an eight point game 70 62 Bolton now bringing the ball on up here for Cincinnati the crowd is getting louder and louder as we speak trying to rattle this Majestic's offense and it will work we're going with the rebound Again, rebounds to this point. The Monsters up 33-23 on the category. Going now. Trying to look for an open man. Does. Finds Letterman. Launches it for two. Bang! Well, it's not really a bang on the three. It's a bang for a two. And it's back to a double-digit lead. Here for the Monsters. Hill now. Again, he has not really had that much on the scoring column but he has been able to put up the assist. Looks to get it inside. Bolton, too strong. Levin with the rebound. Letterman now looks to drive. Big mismatch right there. Ragone now going after Bolton. Benfield versus Mitchell. Looks to cut to his right. Sports right there. Levin throws it on down. And here come the Monsters putting on the Hurt Clinic right now. 11 points for 11. Goes inside. James, oh my goodness. The reverse jam. We have to check out the replay yet again. Lyle James floating on in. Two-hand jam reverse. Very, very nice highlight. going now gets it on over Letterman back up top now gets it on over Hartman for three. Oh, I thought he had it just came up a little short on the corner of the rim Plum now gets it on side James getting blocked right there completely stuffed like a freaking turkey Mickey Hartman man oh man did he put some stank on that one Inbound by Cincinnati. Gets it on over to Bolin. 
Okay, so now I'm out to Klum. Look for the screen to the left. He will. Now he's going to step back. Launch it for a three. Bang! 74-67 is the score here in the fourth quarter. We're going now. Looking for the open man. Gonna go over to Letterman on the right side. Now gets on down to Benfield. Benfield kicks it on back. We're going spin move against Hill. Launches it for two. Gets it to go with a hand all up in his grill. There was no stopping that shot as soon as it got up in the air and just dropped on down. Hill now. Looking to cross over his man. Gets on over it. Wide open. Bowling for three. That right there is just a deadly combination. Looking to lob it up. Oh, Letterman throws it down with the reverse jam on the alley oop attempt. 78 70. James now with the ball up top. Now gets on down to Hill. Hill's going to get hacked right there by Ventfield. His first personal. Hill did not like that one. He got hit pretty hard. I heard the snap all the way from here. It was like a Ric Flair chop. Clum now with the ball in the corner off the inbound. Looks to drive. Stop. Pops for two. Could not get to go. Levin with the rebound. Here comes San Francisco. Hartman up. Gets the nice little layup to go. Bring it back to double digits. We are about to hit the four minute mark and counting here in the fourth quarter. James now hands it off to Bolton. Bolton gets Letterman on the left side. Looks for the screen. Gets it. Wide open James, but no, he's going to be met with the defense. Here comes Klum. Klum watching it for two. Too short. Here come the monsters now. Kenneth Klum, 13 points in this game. Oh my goodness. He gets the shot to go. James will get the defensive foul, and that will now send the and one opportunity for Tony Time Ragon. Wow, what a shot right there for the and one opportunity. The defense of Lyle James draped all over him. Ragon's shot is up, and it is good. 83-70. Free throws on the screen right now. This has been all about trying to get your second chance points at the line. Here comes James for three. Rattled around. Could not get to go. Ventfield with the rebound. The crowd is becoming more and more alive as this game carries on. We're going tries to go inside. Dipped, but Ventfield gets it to go either way. Able to keep the play alive. Field goals on the screen right now. This game is still very close. Oh, and there's a block right there. Defense to offense. Ragone now gets the ball. Looks to cut. Up over. Could not get the shot to go. Klum will be charged with the foul. Tony time Ragone has really sparked it up here in the second half. He started off with four points. He's got 10 going four of five at the line here in the second half. Going to the line yet again for another two. His free throw contribution in this game and what he's really been able to spark here in the second half is why San Francisco climbed back to a commanding lead. Again, free throws on the screen right now. Six of eight and two of three for the Majestic. However, the Monster is still adding up their totals while we have Tony Timer going at the line. Shot is up, and it is good. It is now a 17-point game. Monster is definitely pulling away ahead on this one. Majestic will take a timeout. 2.46 left here in the fourth quarter. As we come back from the break, 
man oh man this game has been nothing but highlights and especially the highlights that you see on your screen right now have definitely helped this out Nathaniel Ventfield definitely becoming one of the top players of this game for San Francisco 87 70 246 Cincinnati was able to climb their way back into it however the monsters able to put fire back into this game Clum now looks to drive up over gets blocked right there defense to offense Kenneth Clum now in a shooting slump he started off with 57 percent in the first half very very bad numbers here in the second Hartman now tries to get inside no it'll be stolen away by Mitchell Cincinnati back on offense about to touch the two minute mark left here in this game James looks to drive gets blocked Ventfield with another block to his total here tonight and this is why the scoring drought is now reached about three minutes for Cincinnati Going with the ball back up top off the pass from Letterman. Cuts to the left, looks to drive, kisses off the glass, rattled around, could not get it to go. James with the rebound, hands it back over to Bolton. Bolton now. Trying to cross up his man. Trying to free himself up. Hill for two, gets it to go. 87 72. A minute 23 left here in the fourth quarter. This game is just about over. There might be a little bit more time. Unless Ventfield gets the three to go. And that right there, ladies and gentlemen. You can put the nail in the coffin. That is all she wrote. San Francisco will walk away with the dub for sure in this game. Clum now, spin move, gets the two to go, just adding to his stat line. Kenneth Clum with 15 tonight. Hartman in his debut here with San Francisco has nine. Less than a minute left here in the game, Monsters now. Letterman gets it on over to Hartman. Hartman versus Clum, we were just talking about that matchup just a second ago. Shot clock about to be a factor. Quick inside pass, Letterman could not get to go. James with the rebound for Cincinnati. Clum now tries to go baseline, gets smacked right there. Another block. The block party here in the last few seconds of this game. Shot clock and game clock are only about three second difference. San Francisco will take the dub here tonight. Cincinnati, however, still on the losing end of things. They had the opportunity to pull away, come back, but it could not happen in their favor. And now the final buzzer will end as the final score will be San Francisco 90, Cincinnati 74. Ladies and gentlemen, this is James Olson signing off for GSSN on PSB coverage. Stay tuned for another game. I'll see you later.